Hi guys, this is literally going to be, excuse me, a bit of gas, just a few minutes. Mainly it was just to show you something that I think you might enjoy. So this little bit here is Heron's. Um, it's got some tender stem, it's 200 grams from there. Um, so that's enough for the weekend. Even these crackers, not Jacob's brand, but the cheaper branded ones, are getting hard to find, especially in Lidl. Um, so yeah, got Jacob's, what were they, two quid? £2,000. And that was uh, Heron's. Right, our Caitlin is all upset over the fact that she can't have Nutella like everybody else. So Steve's grabbed this for her. So if you've got kids out there that have got nut allergy and they would they feel like they're missing out because of this Nutella thing, then get them to, you can get them to try this. Just check the ingredients for yourself and what's suitable for your own, own children. But yeah, he's got some uh, crunchy spread. Not that she'll be having it every day. I don't like stuff like this, to be perfectly honest, for sandwiches for kids. But it's not fair for it to miss out, is it? So got her that. Well, Steve did. I didn't know. Um, it says the ice creams were very limited in choice there as well. So I've got this one. I will eat it because it's ice cream. It's simple as that. I've got anything going really. No. Some of them I don't eat, do I? I don't yeah. eat vanilla. Or a vegan one. Oh, no, I don't like the vegan. Oh. Nothing against vegans, by the way. Don't come for me in the comments, but I didn't like the vegan one. Um, some battered scampi. I'm so pleased that's battered, Steve. I forgot to put... When yeah. I sent him with a list, I said to him, get some battered fish, and I double underlined battered. So I, picked we don't get I picked up Young's and then seen that one and put the Young's back. I like the battered one. But mm. usually they come breaded, don't they? The one, yeah. Yeah, and I said to him, get battered fish as well, not breaded. There's two bacon grill. I can't blame the kids for going through this because this, this is all me. Disgusting. You don't like it at all, do you? No. Some people have tried it because I've had it on here, here you know. If they don't like it, then they're right. <laughs> so there's two of these that I asked him to get. These are 175. That one's a bit fat, fattered. <laughs> that wasn't intentional either, I'm just that great. Anyway, this is the XL range, and this is actually proper fish in here. It's proper cod. It's one pound seventy odd, one seventy five for I think there's four pieces in each. Mm. And obviously my, my kids eat this now. I can't get away with giving them a little fish finger anymore. <laughs> They're not having it. So yeah. They're nice, but, isn't they? Yeah. Wanted some more biscuits. And that's no, they're not for me. Thanks a lot, Steve. You wait until this camera's turned off. <laughs> what I wanted to show you for them that I've got a herons, because I know those down south that watch haven't got one, is these. So these are the boneless chicken thighs. And it really is a chicken thigh. I was shocked. You've seen all these burgers that claim 100% chicken blah 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 well they're not but this we tried this didn't we and that mm. is a proper mm. chicken thigh boneless thigh in there and it is beautiful absolutely beautiful really crunchy yeah you saying i overcooked it no it was nice i liked it <laughs> <laughs> we're going for tea you're not having it for tea you're making tea yeah. anyway getting back to this how you guys watch our holes is beyond us anyway these are what I wanted to show you. It says cut from frozen, nine to ten minutes. I don't do nine to ten minutes. I don't listen to the package instructions. Forty-five minutes. No, I don't do forty-five minutes. I do about forty. Anyway, I just cook it as long as I think it it would take, basically. But these, if you can get them, please, please do try them and let me know what you think. To get a good view of that bag, Steve. And it's a kilo as well. How much are these, Steve? Don't know. Something. Oh, you know what? Seriously. <sighs> anyway, so there it is. If you need to screenshot it for when you go to Herons again, please do try them because they're amazing. Moving on, there's a tiny little little wrist bit from Tesco's. So Steve got himself a battered, <laughs> crushed up tiger baton. He found a couple of these heck breakfast sausages. I've never seen their seen breakfast sausages. What's the difference? I don't I'm understand. Season, I've got the plane. 
Hang on. Yeah, I'll tell you. The gluten free, dairy free. The £2.50 down to £1.90, so it's only 60p off. But any saving is a saving, isn't it? Um, don't really. 60% pork. You'd think for the price it'd be more than 60% pork, wouldn't you? 40% is a Oh, shut up. <laughs> so there's those anyway. I was just having a look to see if it had any certain flavours in it to make it a breakfast sausage, but I can't find it. Eggs. Only ones we could get. There just wasn't any others, so... None at all. None at all at Lidl? No. So we had to get barn ones if we wanted any. So... And then he got... Little Duck made in the UK. Never heard of it. But this is from... Oh, nice. Scented. It's not scented. You just want me to yeah, sniff it. It's scented at the bottom. Floral scent. Delicate floral scent. That's why I can't oh, smell it. Yeah, Ex-smoker, yeah. Steve. I have no sense of smell. <laughs> so, yeah. A pack of uh, butt wipe. So, that was all we got. But the main reason I did this small one is for that. So, please do try it, guys, if you come across it, yeah? And let me know. And I will see you in the next one. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. See you later. Bye.